Shiba Inu is one of the newest cryptocurrencies to break through onto the global scene this year. With over 1 million percent growth in a span of only a few months, it's not hard to see why this token has been making headlines around the world. But the question on everyone's mind and the topic of our video today is whether Shiba Inu will ever reach 1 cent. In this video, we'll go over the mathematics, the fundamentals and the technical analysis for Shiba to break 1 cent. So stay till the end because there are some important details that you don't want to miss out. We'll be giving away $100 to a random subscriber to kickstart their crypto journey. To enter this giveaway, simply like and subscribe and comment your favorite crypto in the comments below. Shiba Inu, known by the community as Sheep, Shiba Coin or Shiba Inu Coin, has been branded as the Doge Killer. And it is not taking this name lightly. So as we know, uh, Dogecoin has soared through the one cent barrier and to the amazement of many, many people has nearly even made it past one dollar. Is a similar future in store for Shiba Inu and are we going in the same direction? Let's have a look. The first thing that we must discuss is what exactly the Shiba Inu token is. Shiba Inu was created back in August 2020, but this year rocketed to incredible highs on the coattails of Dogecoin and a raging cryptocurrency bull market. Dogecoin could be what many consider as the coin that drove a meme coins to mainstream media due to its community support as well as support of many high profile investors like Elon Musk. After the incredible success of Dogecoin, many speculators have been searching for what the next major crypto success will be. Naturally, many of them have come across Shiba Inu, the Dogecoin killer. Although there are literally thousands of copycat style meme coins to choose from, Shiba Inu stands out from the pack for a few clear reasons. First of all, it is the community. The Shiba Inu community on Reddit, also known as the Sheep Army, has grown to nearly 200,000 members in a span of literally just a few months, and is growing every single day. Uh, this has attracted massive levels of attention by people just like you and I. Secondly, as we know, uh, Dogecoin was created entirely as a joke. There were never any major infrastructure plans or exchanges in development for Dogecoin. Well, for Shiba Inu, that is not the case at all. Shiba Inu has major plans in the pipeline and are working on developing real, usable technology and infrastructure such as the Shiba Swap Exchange, an exchange where people can trade Shiba Inu coins with other coins much like Coinbase. This adds real-world utility to the currency. The full infrastructure plan has been laid out transparently in the Shiba Inu white paper, known as the Wolf Paper. Uh, it is for you to check out in the link provided in the description. As explained in the Wolf Paper, Shiba has been designed to be a deflationary coin. This means that upon release, there was a total supply of 1 quadrillion tokens and over time, the circulating supply will only ever be reduced as more and more tokens are burned. In other words, the number of coins will never increase. With traditional currency, you can simply just print more but not with sheep. Currently, over 60% of the original circulating supply has been burned, meaning that they are permanently removed forever. As of the time of this video being published, uh, there are already only less than 400 trillion tokens left, which is about 40% left. Although this seems like a huge number, it is only ever going to get smaller. Now to better understand the path ahead, we must first consider how Sheep has made it from this number upon inception to where it sits today. Sheep's rise of over 1 million percent has obviously been due to Dogecoin's success, which we can attribute to a combination of celebrities, influential figures such as Elon Musk, social media platforms such as Twitter and Reddit, and of course YouTube. By generating so much discussion about Dogecoin, it has become a household name in an incredibly short amount of time. The same thing, but on a much smaller scale nonetheless, has been happening for the Shiba Inu coin. So what could she be worth in the future? Could it ever reach one cent? That is the big question. From reading the wolf paper, we can see Sheep clearly has some very intriguing plans for the future. Some of these plans could make Sheba very commercially viable for real world use. But is one cent really a viable target? Let's actually do the maths and find out. We're going to look at this from three different perspectives. Uh, the first one is what would need to happen to the supply chain, to the supply of the Shiba Inu coin for this to happen. Second one is what needs to happen to demand in terms of the growth, the news, the catalyst. And the last perspective is what we can expect reasonably and practically from the first two combined. And finally, we're going to do a case study where if Shiba Inu experienced the same catalyst and success as Dogecoin, how much will the coin likely be? Let's have a quick look over the maths right now for this. Right now, the price of Shiba Inu is currently sitting at this particular price. If we punch in one cent, that will result in a market cap of 3950 
billion dollars. For the sake of comparison, $3,950 billion, or let's just put $4,000 billion for short, is going to place Shiba Inu above the market cap of Ethereum and below Bitcoin. We can see on the number 6 spot we have Dogecoin. Dogecoin is currently sitting at $30 billion. If Shiba Inu hits 1 cent, that means the market cap is going to be 10 times bigger than what is currently for Dogecoin right now at $30 billion. I want you guys to have a different perspective. So right now the total market capitalization excluding Bitcoin is at roughly $700 billion. And Ethereum, Tether and Binance adds up to roughly 300 a bit, a bit over $300 billion. So that means that if we remove Bitcoin, Ethereum, Tether and Binance coin, we have a total market cap of around $400 billion. So if Shiba Inu hits 1 cent, the value of Shiba Inu will be the combination of the entire crypto market minus these four coins. Although this is technically possible, it doesn't seem to be grounded in reality. And now let's discuss what could actually get the price of Shiba to 1 cent. There are two talking points I want to discuss here. The first one is the supply and circulation aspect of the Shiba Inu coin and the second one is demand. So let's have a look at supply first. So at the launch of the Shiba Inu coin, there was one quadrillion coins. And right now in the circulating supply, we have 400 trillion. One of the reasons that it's only 40% of what it used to be is because of the burning of tokens. So what is burning a token? It essentially refers to sending an otherwise usable token to an unusable account. So what this does is it removes the token from the available supply, increasing its relative scarcity, which in consequence drives the prices up. And in one of the most significant crypto events in history, also dubbed as one of the most generous events in crypto history, the co-founder of Ethereum, Buterin, burned 90% of his Shiba Inu tokens and donates the rest to charity. So the co-founder of Ethereum was gifted 40% of the total circulation of Shiba Inu coins, 410 trillion coins, which were worth about $7 billion at the time. So he burned around 90% of that, so roughly 400 trillion tokens. And if we exclude this unicorn event, around 20% of the tokens were burned by smaller investors or smaller owners of Shiba Inu. So let's go back to my spreadsheet. Let's make an assumption here. Suppose that the market cap does not change. What supply of Shiba Inu coin is required for the price to be one cent? So if we take the current market cap here and divide it by its price of one cent, which is what we want it to be, we have a total of this number. Um, I don't know what this number is from first look. So let me just divide it by 1 billion. So that means the circulating supply needs to be 269 billion for the current price to be worth 1 cent. Now let's reverse calculate this. So if we take the um, current supply, take away what the supply needs to be, we have this number here, which is, I believe, looks like 394 trillion. Now, historically, Butrin has burned 400 trillion and we have seen 200 trillion being burned from its circulating supply. And considering that over 600 trillion Shiba Inu coins have already been burned, while it is unlikely, it is still possible to anticipate that more coins will be burned in the future. A large enough burn event or a series of large burns could literally drive the prices all the way up to one cent per coin. Again, while this is not impossible, it is not very likely, not for the immediate future at least. Now, the second point I want to talk about is demand and increasing of demand. And demand happens when there is infrastructure and when there is popularity and when there is discussions about this particular coin and its uses. So in terms of infrastructure, it means that there are more uses and more exchanges that the coin could be traded on. So for now, we have the Shiba swap that is coming up and there have been small businesses that are starting to accept the Shiba Inu coin. With regards to its popularity, which is, I guess, is another word for adoption, because as more people adopt the coin and the community of the coin grows, so well, in a sense, its popularity. So for mass adoption to occur, we need influencers to promote the coin. We need influencers to bring awareness to the Shiba Inu coin and the Shiba Inu community. And one such driving force in the crypto market, which is the case for Dogecoin was Elon Musk. As we know, Elon Musk uh, talked about Dogecoin publicly on Twitter around the early part of April, so roughly this period. And since then, uh, Elon Musk continuously talked about Dogecoin and how it can be used as a token of the future. And Elon really rallied the coin 
by even appearing on Saturday Night Live and talking about Dogecoin. As a result of these efforts, we can see that the prices of Dogecoin have increased approximately a thousand percent to its peak. While it's quite difficult to measure demand, we can only really use anecdotal evidence to put an objective number on the Shiba Inu value. Let's suppose the similar thing happened for Shiba Inu. Let's say we have a huge, huge influencer who started promoting the Shiba Inu coin. And let's suppose this person may or may not be Elon Musk, it doesn't really matter, but for the purpose of the discussion, we're going to use the 1000% growth for the Shiba Inu coin. So if we go back to my spreadsheet and if we simply just multiply by a thousand percent, which is a thousand divided by a hundred, we still have, we're still quite a bit from a one cent goal. So what we have just done is we have just only altered either the supply or the demands. Uh, but what about if we alter both of them together simultaneously? What would that look like? Let's have a look. So coming back to my spreadsheet, suppose that we had a thousand percent growth for the Shiba Inu coin, which is this figure here. Let me just bring that number down. And this will result, uh, given its current supply, a market cap of, let me just check the sales. Yep. We have this value of a market cap, which is approximately $269 billion dollars now if we take our one cent gold supply number which is this number here bring it over values only and then we'll check the difference between these two numbers we still have as you can see guys 394 trillion coins of difference that needs to be burned now again this is still quite unlikely to happen but it is much easier than if we just change a single number of the things that we have just discussed so if one cent is little more than wishful thinking for the Shiba Inu coin, what is actually reasonable target that we might actually see within a period of months or potentially years? For me to answer this question, we have to use a bit of a case study. So let's use Dogecoin as an example. Dogecoin reached a market cap of over $80 billion in May of 2021. And we're going to use the same number, $80 billion, as a market cap for the Shiba Inu coin. And we know that 200 trillion Shiba Inu coins have been burned, excluding what Butron has done. We're going to take the assumption that another mass burning event were to happen and another 200 trillion coins have been wiped off the circulation supply. Um, just going back to my spreadsheet here and let's delete all of these numbers. So assuming my market supply, so assuming our market supply is now 80 billion dollars and we have wiped off another 200 trillion of the supply cap so let's just say this number divide by a half what can we expect the price to be the reasonable price is the market cap divided by the circulating supply this number here now while this might seem small this is four one hundredth of a cent let's look at how much more it currently is compared to its current price so if we go this number here divided by the current price it is actually a 60 fold increase in price a 60 fold in price is what we can reasonably expect if things were to go reasonably well for the shiba inu coin and the shiba inu community but of course things can always go better than expected now taking dogecoin as an example again during its launch dogecoin was worth no more than five million dollars and at its peak dogecoin was almost worth 80 billion dollars so we shouldn't rule the one cent goal out. It is just unlikely, but keep in mind, it is not impossible. Nonetheless, there is still a big difference between the one cent goal and the current fair estimate of the Shiba Inu price. Now, I want you guys to have a think about this with regards to the Dogecoin case. No one in the right mind expected Doge to hit 10 cents, let alone break above 50 cents. And here we are that Dogecoin peaked above 60 cents. There is a phrase that I like to say with regards to the crypto market. Things that have never happened before happen all the time. I want to share a bit of a personal experience with you guys. In uh, early 2015 or late 2014, I was told by a group of friends about this thing called cryptocurrency and Bitcoin. At the time, Bitcoin was a few hundred dollars. And uh, at the time, they told me to get in on this new thing. <laughs> and uh, regretfully, I laughed. I said to them, well, what's the point of this thing when you can't even buy things that are half legitimate? And you went from the measly few hundred dollars to the peak of, I think, close to 70,000 USD. And that was one of the biggest things I regret with regards to cryptocurrency and with trading in general. 
I simply uh, didn't believe them. I thought it was absolute lunacy. Um, there was no way. And here we are six years later. Yes way. Coming back to Shiba, at the end of the day, you need to really consider all of the possibilities for Shiba or any cryptocurrency you invest your money into, that as well as going up, prices can and often do go down. And for this reason, you need to be sure you're never investing more than you're comfortable with losing. It is important that we don't get too carried away with imagining the possibilities of what life would be like if Shiba Inu was to reach one cent or beyond. Although I personally have invested into Shiba Inu coin and I can see a very bright future for this cryptocurrency, I do not expect it to make me a millionaire. Not anytime soon at least. We need to invest with our heads and not with our hearts. Let us know in the comments what your predictions are for how high Shiba Inu can go this year. And as always, take care and see you next time.